lives right at the beginning of well, up here I can't get cars. Amanda Randolph walks us through the mud, through the mess, through the dozens of volunteers. Using chainsaws, cleaning up her home after a tornado chewed through the neighborhood. I was right here. So I don't know how I got out. I don't know how I survived. A tree narrowly missing her as she sat in this now unrecognizable smash black Honda. The sky, but it's like the wind, maybe rain, whatever. Everything was like a gray and then a green color. And I could feel my whole car shaking and it sounded like a freight train. It's exactly the way they say it is. It happened so fast, no warning. Suffering a few broken ribs. Tonight, she's without a car, her belongings. But this brush with death put her life in perspective. Like so many of us do, Amanda, have been going through a rough time. I've come to this point in life where everything's gotten really hard lately. I'm newly divorced and got three kids trying to learn how this divorce thing works. She thought she had reached a breaking point. I just don't know how much more I can take. It's hard. It's really hard. I mean, that day in particular, like I would have been completely okay with just like not existing. And but in that moment, she thought her life could be over. There was clarity. Sit in my car that night like I just didn't want to die so bad. She knew her children, her life was worth believing in. I'm so grateful for whatever was looking out for me because I wouldn't be here without it.